the Hong Kong government has launched a new app called Leave Home Safe to help people keep track of where they've been to help with contact tracing for COVID-19. Here's how it works. All right, I'm here to download the uh, government Leave Home Safe app. Okay, I gotta scan this to download the app. In the app store, download it here. Read. Okay, so you scan the QR code then you can match where you've been with uh, where a case that's confirmed has been as well. And the app will notify you if you visited some place that a confirmed patient has gone to recently. Here we go. going to scan that I've been here. So the app will keep a record of all the places I've been. And government officials have said that none of that information will be kept on a central server and will just be kept on my phone. And all that data will be deleted after 31 days. But if somebody who's uh, infected with COVID-19 has visited the same place around the same time that I've visited, the app will notify me and give me advice on what to do. So let me record my visit. I'm right here in the central library. Let me scan that. So it has recorded that I've been to the library. Alrighty, so I've left the library. Let me say that I've left here as well. Yes, I'm leaving now. I'm at the Dalongzhou Market here in Causeway Bay. This one was a bit difficult to find. I'm here at the bank in busy Causeway Bay. Let me scan in as well. Here we go. So I'm at the supermarket here at Park and Shop, but there's nothing for me to scan. So I'm gonna have to record this in my own notes. All right, so based on my experience today with this app, I've seen quite a lot of people just walk by the QR code or simply uh, not want to download it, citing, for example, privacy reasons or because it doesn't seem as beneficial to them. For some places, it was easier to see the QR code, like at the bank, which is at the front of the door. But at the market, it was a little bit difficult to see just because it was on the wall, but kind of lower down with a lot of other posters and obscured by carts and other things. Uh, and also, while I was walking around Causeway Bay today, I didn't notice a lot of restaurants or shops that had this QR code. So hopefully there will be more to come um, as the government tries to track down close contacts of confirmed cases.